This is Urdizzle back with a little game of What Happens. This is Lost Island Hole 2. I've got a tee shot here with my glide roll, Blista Pro. And about halfway through the flight, before it lands, I'm going to pause and let you guys decide what you think happens based on the flight of the disc. Let's see how good you guys are. All right, so we've got a tailwind right to left of about three. So we get about right here. So we've got our roll disc, and we've got some options here. So the question is, what do you think with a headwind the disc is going to do here? So here are your choices. Option A, does the disc slam into that stone straight ahead of me and just stop? Be an easy putt. Or option B, hits that same stone, ricochets to the left, and almost goes in the basket. Option C, hits that stone, skips up, and rolls long like roller discs sometimes do. It goes all the way out of bounds long. D, hits the ground and just completely stops and doesn't do anything. Crazier things have happened. Or option E, none of the above. Well, let's see what happens. Yep, somehow the disc hits the left side of that stone tablet and doesn't ricochet left, doesn't go straight, doesn't stop. It somehow kicks right into the water. And shows how much I've been playing this course or not playing the course. I didn't know they added a drop zone to this. I actually thought going in the water that I was going to have a nice easy throw in for my par. Nope, ended up getting a bogey off that shot yeah not sure what to say on that one i guess that's disc golf valley